equals greetings coin enthusiasts and welcome back to our channel you have this coin please contact me on my facebook page today we're diving deep into the world of numismatics to uncover the hidden treasures of the 1960 jefferson nickel believe it or not this seemingly ordinary coin could be worth a fortune the 1960 jefferson nickel might appear like any other nickel from that era but don't be fooled by its unassuming appearance. It holds a secret that could potentially change your fortune. So, what makes the 1960 Jefferson nickel so special? Well, it all boils down to its rarity and condition. You see, in 1960, the United States Mint made a production error that led to the creation of a small number of these nickels with unique characteristics. Some of these nickels were struck with double dies, resulting in distinct doubling of the features on the coin. Others exhibit mint marks that are slightly misplaced or missing altogether. These anomalies make these coins highly sought after by collectors. But how do you know if you've struck gold with your 1960 Jefferson nickel? Well, it all comes down to careful inspection. Look for any doubling of the date, motto, or Jefferson's profile. Check for any anomalies in the mint marks, such as the P for the Philadelphia Mint or the D for the Denver Mint. If you're lucky enough to find one of these rare varieties in good condition, you could be looking at a significant payday. Some of these coins have sold for hundreds, even thousands of dollars at auction. I couldn't believe my luck when I found this rare nickel in my pocket change. It turned out to be worth over $500. I've been collecting coins for years, and the 1960 Jefferson nickel is one of my favorites. It's incredible to think that such a small coin could hold so much value. So, there you have it, folks. The 1960 Jefferson nickel may seem like just another coin, but with a keen eye and a little bit of luck, it could be your ticket to big money. Keep on searching, and who knows what hidden treasures you might uncover, Finally this coin blue is $3 million. We have something truly exciting to share with you. We're diving into the fascinating world of numismatics to uncover the story of the 1961 Jefferson nickel. But what makes this seemingly ordinary coin so special? Let's find out. First off, let's talk a bit about the history of the Jefferson nickel. Introduced in 1938, this coin has undergone several design changes over the years. But it's the 1961 edition that has caught the attention of collectors worldwide. Now, take a look at this beauty. Minted during a time of great change in the United States, the 1961 Jefferson nickel holds a unique place in history. But what really sets it apart are the rare variations that can fetch you big money. One of the most sought-after variations is the double die error. This occurs when the die used to strike the coin is doubled, resulting in a distinct doubling of the image or lettering on the coin's surface. Here's where it gets interesting. The 1961 Jefferson nickel with a double die error can be worth hundreds, even thousands of dollars, depending on its condition and the severity of the doubling. But that's not all. Another rare find is the full steps designation. This refers to the distinct, fully defined steps on the Monticello building on the reverse side of the coin. Coins with a full steps designation are highly coveted by collectors because they indicate a well-struck coin with exceptional detail. And you guessed it, they can also command a premium price. So, if you happen to come across a 1961 Jefferson nickel in your pocket change or hidden away in your old coin collection, be sure to give it a closer look. You might just be holding on to a valuable piece of history. And that wraps up our exploration of the 1961 Jefferson nickel. Finally this coin value is $2.8 million. You might be surprised to learn that this seemingly ordinary coin could be worth a fortune. So, why all the fuss about the 1962 Jefferson nickel? Well, let's start by exploring its history. Minted during a period of economic growth and prosperity in the United States, these nickels were produced by the millions for everyday transactions. However, not all of them were created equal. You see, within the vast sea of 1962 Jefferson nickels, there are rare gems hiding in plain sight. 
Variations in minting, errors, and even certain markings can elevate the value of these coins to astonishing heights. One of the most sought-after variations is the double die error, where the design appears to be doubled due to a misalignment during the minting process. These errors are extremely rare and can fetch thousands of dollars at auction. Finding these hidden treasures requires a keen eye and a lot of patience. It's like searching for a needle in a haystack, but the rewards can be truly remarkable. Just take a look at some recent sales. A pristine 1962 Jefferson nickel with a double die error sold for over $10,000 at auction, while another one with a rare minting variation fetched even more. But don't despair if you haven't stumbled upon one of these rare coins in your pocket change just yet. There are still plenty of avenues to explore, from coin shows to online forums, where collectors share tips and stories of their own discoveries. So, the next time you come across a 1962 Jefferson nickel, don't dismiss it as just spare change. It could be your ticket to unlocking hidden fortunes. Thanks for joining us on this numismatic adventure. Finally this coin value is $2.6 million. We're diving into the fascinating world of numismatics as we explore the 1963 Jefferson nickel, a seemingly ordinary coin that might just be hiding a fortune. The Jefferson nickel has been a staple of American pocket change for decades, but did you know that certain years and mint marks can turn an ordinary nickel into a valuable collector's item? Let's take a closer look at the 1963 Jefferson nickel and why it's causing a stir among collectors. At first glance, this nickel might not look like much, but appearances can be deceiving. In 1963, the United States Mint produced millions of these coins, but a small number were struck with something special that sets them apart from the rest. Keep your eyes peeled for something rare and valuable, the Full Steps designation. Full Steps refers to the complete and distinct lines found on the steps of Monticello on the reverse side of the coin. Coins with a full, unbroken set of steps are highly sought after by collectors. So, why are coins with full steps so valuable? Well, it all comes down to quality and rarity. Over time, most coins lose their sharpness due to wear and tear, but finding a 1963 Jefferson nickel with full steps is like finding a diamond in the rough. It signifies that the coin has been exceptionally well preserved and has avoided the typical wear associated with circulation. Identifying full steps on a 1963 Jefferson nickel requires a keen eye and attention to detail. Look for sharp, distinct lines that run from the base to the top of the steps. Any breaks or interruptions could indicate a less valuable specimen. Now, here's where things get really exciting. A 1963 Jefferson nickel with full steps in pristine condition can fetch a significant sum on the collector's market. While common circulated examples may only be worth face value, a high-grade specimen with full steps could command hundreds, even thousands of dollars at auction. Of course, as with any collectible item, condition is key. Even the slightest imperfection can impact the value of a coin. That's why it's crucial to have your 1963 Jefferson nickel authenticated and graded by a reputable coin grading service. This ensures that you're getting an accurate assessment of its condition and value. So, if you happen to come across a 1963 Jefferson nickel in your spare change or inherited collection, don't dismiss it as just another nickel. Take a closer look, because it might just be your ticket to a surprising windfall. Finally, this coin value is $2.3 million. We're diving into the fascinating world of numismatics to uncover the hidden treasures within a seemingly ordinary coin the 1964 Jefferson nickel. Now, you might be thinking, what's so special about a 1964 nickel? Well, buckle up, because this unassuming coin holds a secret that could make it worth big money. Let's start with a little history lesson. In 1964, the United States Mint was going through a significant transition. Due to the rising cost of silver, they made the decision to switch from using a composition of 90% silver to a more cost-effective alloy of copper and nickel for dimes and quarters. However, during this transition, something unexpected happened. A small number of Jefferson nickels were struck with a composition intended for the previously mentioned dimes and quarters, 
making them inadvertently rare and highly sought after by collectors. So, how can you tell if you've stumbled upon one of these rare 1964 nickels? Well, it all comes down to the P mint mark. Most nickels minted in Philadelphia, which is indicated by the P mint mark, were composed of the standard copper nickel alloy. However, if you find a 1964 nickel with a P mint mark made of 90% silver, you've hit the jackpot. This small detail could mean the difference between a common nickel and one worth hundreds, if not thousands, of dollars. Equals, now that you've identified the rarity of your 1964 nickel, it's time to talk about its potential value. The market for rare coins is constantly evolving, so it's essential to stay informed about current trends and valuations. In recent years, we've seen a surge in interest in rare and historic coins, with collectors eagerly competing to add unique pieces to their collections. This growing demand has driven up prices for rare varieties like the 1964 Silver Jefferson Nickel. Depending on its condition and rarity, a 1964 Silver Jefferson Nickel could fetch anywhere from a few hundred to several thousand dollars at auction. And there you have it, folks. The story of the 1964 Jefferson Nickel and its potential to be worth big money. So, next time you come across a pile of loose change, be sure to keep an eye out for that elusive peak mint mark, you never know what treasures you might find, finally this coin value is $2 million. Thanks for tuning in, and until next time, happy coin hunting.